I like memes. You like memes. Let's watch some memes. Alright, so and this is the third episode of Mips. Okay. I'm gonna have some fun. <laughs> now let's start with our first meme. For someone that went to a Spanish and black school, I'm not even surprised that this shit is on here. I've seen most fucking Hispanic motherfuckers with this haircut, and I'm not gonna say which one, because, you know, I'm gonna start a war. But, you know, if you had this haircut, you needed to shut the fuck up. <laughs> no cap. <laughs> but he even got the fucking necklace and everything. <laughs> God, if you had this, you'd be speeding in a little fucking Honda. <laughs> oh my God. You know what you would call Vatos with this kind of haircut? You would either call him Kevin, Jose, Eduardo, Edgar, but mainly Edgar. Because an Edgar with this haircut was honestly like a Chad. You know, it's like the Chad of Puerto Ricans. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> it's like the Jose of Puerto Ricans. <laughs> oh my god, let me stop before I get shanked. Next, so you're from New Jersey, or are you gonna tell me about Wawa too? Yo, hell yeah, I'm gonna tell you about Wawa. Wawa was the best. Wawa was the shit, bro. Wawa is like a a kid in a candy store. Okay, I'm being s dead serious right now. Like, I'm not trying to joke. Wawa is like an Italian's place house. Okay? <laughs> Dude, you can't go anywhere without Wawa. Okay? You you want some fucking breakfast at like 9 p.m., you go you go to Wawa. Fuck quick check. Quick what the fuck quick check has. Hoagies? Man, you can get that Wawa too. Nah, but seriously, Wawa is the best. Don't quote me on that. Oh, no. Oh, what the fuck? Dude, I'm getting nervous from this shit. I'm getting serious PTSD vibes right now. This is the most disgusting shit I've ever seen. <laughs> fuck no. Fuck no. No. <laughs> Dude. Y'all ever seen that uh, uh, grapefruit video with the lady that had that one big black ass dildo. And she's just doing all. <laughs> Dude. No. <laughs> Alright, so the caption says, my roommate eats fruit really weird. <laughs> Fuck that. That is disgusting. <laughs> That is really nasty. I hope your, I hope, you know, I'm not judging. I hope your roommate is a girl. <laughs> Cause if it's a guy, well, shit, and you're a guy, well, I don't know how to help you, boo. <laughs> I don't know how to help you, boo. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> this shit's gonna give me nightmares, bro. Next, when you skip head day, I'm gonna be honest. This shit ain't even fucking funny. I mean, neither am I. But listen. At least I tried this shit. I don't know what the fuck this shit is. All right. I get that it's like poking fun of people that don't exercise a certain body type. And so another a different type of body looks like chicken legs. But honestly, this shit whack. <laughs> so what? The dude just has to give like mad head. <laughs> He's trying to give mad head to, to get his shit back to, like, you know, full size. Oh, no. And what makes it worse is the dude in the background, he's like, oh, yeah. <laughs> the fuck? I don't know why, but I don't know why they're looking at me like that. Like, they want some dick or something. <laughs> I don't know, bro, but, hey, look, this dude's vain. That shit be looking like a dude. Like an actual dick. Like that shit bigger than my own dick. Dude, he can fuck a girl with his own fucking veins. What the fuck? Hey, you know, I'm looking at his, at this dude's chest like, this dude got bigger tits than my fucking mom. What the fuck is that about? 
bro. Like, I, if I was friends with this dude, I would have been like, bro, hide that shit. My mom's gonna get jealous. What the fuck, Vato? <laughs> Feel old yet? Question mark. No, because it's the same fucking picture. What the fuck are you trying to tell me? All right, now let me stop playing before this bitch sues me, all right? <laughs> all right, so we got Danielle Brogelli on the left side, and I don't know who the hell the bitch on the right side is, but looking by the picture, I don't even want to know. She looks like she could steal my car just for a pack of cigarettes, all right? She would literally steal my car. So to some puto in the in a in like a Edgar haircut, and the next thing I know, I'm gonna see my car drive down the street with some rims slammed as fuck. It's gonna have a body kit all in the same fucking day. The next day, okay, I'm gonna see that bitch roll down the street blasting some fucking bad bunny shit, and. It's still going to have the same license plate. I'm like, what the fuck? You know, I can't even be mad because it's Bad Bunny. <laughs> He's playing Bad Bunny. How can I be mad? All right. But no, nah, seriously. These two. Ratchet. Next. You know, not to toot my own horn over here, but I was honestly the fastest kid in, in elementary school. Okay. I was the fastest kid in elementary school, besides Miles, okay? Can we just stick to the fact that there was a kid in our class named Miles, and he was one of the fastest kids? Dang. Bro, we said Miles, because he runs for Miles. <laughs> nah, but on a serious note, I was the fastest kid, but uh, the meme, it says, how it feels to play tag with with the one stupidly fast kid. Yeah, that was me. That was me, bro. No one could, could touch me. <laughs> I was fast as fuck, boy. <laughs> oh, bro. Especially with that Naruto run, bro. If you did the Naruto run, bro, you... No one would have got it. <laughs> now, if you do the Naruto run, you might as well move to a different school. All right, because you're going to get bullied by everyone, even the dweebs. Even the dweebs know, don't be doing that shit. Because you're going to be looking stupid as fuck. On a serious note, though, look at how my man Tails looking right now. He buffing us all trying to catch something like, come here, bitch. <laughs> Why are you trying to get with Amy? <laughs> Even though Amy wants, uh, wants Sonic, though, but, like, you know. Tails wants some of that Amy butt. But listen. Tails, you're gonna get your chance, bro. <laughs> Don't beat yourself up, bro. Like, come on, man. You ripped this fuck. I'm trying to catch Sonic like this. Now I'm just bullshitting right now. Because I'm trying to make this video a little longer than usual. <laughs> Please support. Please support. Comment down. Give me likes. K subscribe. I'm just trying to pay for these hospital bills, okay? <laughs> God, I'm stupid. Bitch, fuck this. Scientists discover a winged spider. And the bottom part says, the what? Hell no. Fuck no. If I see this shit flying anywhere near me, you know I'm gonna drop down like, uh. <laughs> fuck that. <laughs> you got me fucked up, motherfucker. <laughs> you stupid... Hell no. This shit is the spawn of Satan. This shit came out of Satan's asshole right now. This shit came out of Satan's asshole. This fucking Satan birthed this shit right now. Satan birthed this shit and trying to make 2020 worse than it is right now. Fuck no. <laughs> Bitch, you don't need a knee braid, bro. What you need is a flamethrower. <laughs> Fuck that. Dude, if I'm walking with my girl and this shit flies... Fuck. Throw that bitch at her. Throw that bitch at the fucking winged spider. Fuck that. Mm -mm. Save my own damn self. Fuck that shit. Uh-uh. 
Nope. You ain't gonna catch me. Uh-uh. Fuck. <laughs> you got me fucked up. <laughs> on a serious note, though, I love the meme on the bottom. Because it emphasizes shit that we don't fucking want to hear. It's like, the what? Like, what the fuck? The fuck? The what? <laughs> bro, I can't, bro. I really can't. I see this shit flying near me. Shit, I have to call fucking Ghostbusters and fucking everyone from Final Fantasy 15 to kill this bitch. Fuck this. I'd rather die. As soon as I see that shit flying around, my heart drops all the way to the fucking bottom. You won't even see me, bro. I dropped that right there. Alright, next. Whoa there, this episode's kind of long, but anyway. Yo, listen. Alright, listen. I look cute without my glasses, okay? I heard that before. I heard that I look cute without my glasses. Fuck you. Not as cute as this fucking panda, but listen. When your friend takes their glasses off... Look, man, I'm li- I'm pretty. <laughs> I'm kidding. No, the fuck I'm not. Why am I lying? <laughs> But no, um, you know, this is pretty much it. Um, I don't know what else to say. The, you know, the what? Um, I guess. <laughs> I'm trying to be funny over here. Like, just give me a fucking like. Or a dislike. Like, I don't care. Or just threaten me. <laughs> um, but yeah. This is honestly true, though. People are not used to you... When you take off your glasses, you're just like, whoa, you got eyes. <laughs> but yeah, that's pretty much it. <laughs> this is honestly worse than the fucking Edgar haircut. Like, who has the right mind to just put a fucking moon on the side of their fucking skull? Like, how, how high do you have to be to put a fucking moon on the side of your skull. What you looking for? You ever use that clone stamp tool with the hard brush selector? And the barber says, wait, what does the barber say? Say no more, fam. You gotta cut that shit off. Like, like I can't even roast you, bro. Like, you, you just look stupid already. Like, have you ever seen those people that just make themselves look stupid? Yeah, you're one of them kids. You're like one of those kids that your mom makes you want to play with because they feel bad for you. Well, that was me, okay? But you were the other type of kid. (laughs) You're the type of kid that no one wanted to play with. (laughs) That's mean as fuck, bro. (laughs) Let me stop. Yo, you look like this one kid that I grew up with. He, uh, He went down to Florida, came back, and I don't know, bro. Having a child right now. But you, sir, you look stupid. <laughs> stupid as motherfuckers. <laughs> oh my god. Um. Well, other than that, his hair is actually pretty fly, except for that fucking moon on the side of his head. Shit. It's gonna make the fucking shuttle land there. <laughs> Uh, Apollo, we have landed one small step for human, one big ass step for stupidity. Alright, um, so I'm gonna end it off with this double post meme, or double meme, whatever the fuck you wanna call it, I don't give a shit. Um, me thinking about how my boyfriend had other girlfriends before me, hey yo, look man, look man. You know how hard it is to date a girl who had boyfriends before? Like, you just think they're in and just... You just image your girl getting piped down by her black boyfriend. Like, fuck. How am I supposed to compete with that? (laughs) Bro, I can't. Let me stop. (laughs) You know how hard it is to, like, imagine your girl getting dicked down by fucking... 
weird owl over there with the fucking uh, 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 nasty ass goatee. Like, nah, bro, that's disgusting. You would think it's hard. It's hard for us. Like, we can't. We can't imagine putting our dick inside someone else's sloppy second meat. Okay, that is disgusting. Like, you you put your dick in that shit. And so will other people after you if you ain't trying to take that shit seriously, okay? Just imagine how nasty that shit is. And you think it's hard. <laughs> oh, fuck that. That hole is a fucking hallway by now. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> oh, no, okay. And the post on the right says... Boys will like everything you post until you become their girlfriend. That is true. That is so fucking true. But to be honest, I don't like anyone. I don't even like my own posts. I don't like anyone's posts. Just remember that. Whenever I'm fucking Facebook and I'm sharing shit, I am not going to react to your shit. <laughs> I am not reacting to your fucking meme. I'm taking that shit. I don't care. <laughs> That's why people don't like me. So I don't agree with you. Uh, labor. It's fucking sounding like labia. You fucking vagina. <laughs> Alright, let me stop. Let me stop. But uh, yeah, that concludes. Concludes. Con not not conclude. That concludes myth episode three. Thank you guys for watching. Love you guys. Peace. Thank you.